See? Now this separates them. This separates them. Even a couple of happy birthday traps like this. It separates them, which is what we really want. See? Look at them. Two are dead over there. And you're gonna follow. What's up, playing Crash Survivors? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for the Forest. Now, today, we were going to work on the storehouse. Um, I don't really know what to call this. I'm calling it the storehouse for now. If you, it's my storage building. If you have a better name for it, just let me know in the comments. Um, I was going to work on this today, but I have been waylaid by cannibals, like, nonstop. I've been doing some uh, work off camera. And they have just been coming at me in droves. Really annoying. I can't get anything done. Um, you know, it's hard to get the bones from them. It's hard to combat them. I, I'm not a big fan of this axe. Uh, it's just too damn slow. And actually, I'm not sure how much is, how much damage this axe actually does to the cannibals. Because I've beat cannibals with this like eight, nine, ten times. And they still haven't died. So, I don't know. I'm not convinced, guys. I'm not convinced. Maybe I'll do some fighting with you today, just to show you. But I've wailed on cannibals with this thing. And um, they just, they get stunned, but they don't really die, right? So, you know, I've had a hard time uh, fighting them. I've been doing some off-camera work, but I've been just attacked repeatedly. Really, really annoying. So, what we need to do is we need to make the bone zone. So, um, my first idea for the bone zone was going to be... By the way, we're probably going to get... We're probably going to get attacked out here. My first idea for the bone zone was going to be right in front of my door. Somewhere over here. Um, I'm not really sure about that now. I kind of... Like, someone gave me the idea of making this like a spooky forest and putting all kinds of traps in it and stuff. Okay, here we go. Watch how this thing works. Come on. Come on over here. Over here, Leatherface. Oh, there's two of them. They always come in twos. Alright. If I could fight one at a time, then I'll use the... Oh, nah, never mind. Alright, I can't be messing around when there's a few of them. All right, let's get this guy. There we go. The other guy's coming around. He looks like he might be stuck. He's stuck in my traps. I don't know if those things are actually hurting him or not, but he was stuck in them. All right, one down. Let's go ahead and bring him inside. Not that there's really inside right now because my wall isn't complete, but I think you get what I'm saying. Okay, so yeah, I kind of like this to be like a spooky forest with like um, all kinds of traps and stuff. So I'm going to leave the trees alone in here. So that means we can't make the bone zone. So the other thing I was thinking about is maybe make the bone zone over here. Uh, you know what, let's grab some blueberries while we're here. Okay, there we go. Or what we could do is we can make the bone zone um, down here. Uh, I, there's good... There's. No, I don't want to make the bone zone down at the bottom of a hill. That's not going to work. No, that's not going to work for me. I think we should make the bone zone right about here. What's up, bro? All right, watch this axe. Watch the axe. Here we go. You ready? No, no, no. Don't run away. Don't run away. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, six. It took six times for him to go down. That's actually not as bad as I thought, but it's still, I mean, just make sure he's dead. They can be revived. Somehow, um, even if they're dead, someone said they could be revived even if they're dead. I, I don't know about that, but I don't know. Maybe they can. Who knows? All right. So I think I'm going to put the bone zone. Or we could put the bone zone over here and leave over there for the spooky forest. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Let's do the bone zone over here. I want the spooky forest thing, but the bone zone is more important right now. So I'm thinking, like, I want it to be pretty close to my base. All right. Um, this should be a pretty decent spot for it i do have tnt okay great let me get some log suds up here oh my god guys they really sent a lot of guys after me holy crap we we really need the bone zone guys this has to get done today can't be screwing around oh man this is rough dude there's a lot of guys up there all right buddy time for you to die i mean i'm doing my best but there's like six guys up there there we go see i like this thing so much more you still alive? Nope, you're not alive. All right, we're going to bring you over here. This is where I'm keeping the bodies. Hopefully, we'll come out with a lot of bones here. All right, let's go ahead and repair this. All right. And here we go. What's up, guys? Oh, my God. There's a lot of them. All right, let's get up here. Shoot them with some arrows. This is rough, dude. Whew. They are not playing around. Unfortunately for them, neither am I. All right, guys. Time to get lit up. Where are you? There you are. There you go. You're on fire. 
Okay. Where's the other ones? I hear them down there, but I don't see them. Oh. Okay, there's another one over there. You're on fire again. And they're really hammering on that wall. Oh, God. All right, here we go. Oh. Okay. Hey, you guys get preoccupied with the wall. You're doing noble work. Okay. Kind of chill. Okay. All right, trying to surround me. Not going to work. This guy's got to be low on hit points. Yep, he's dead. All right, cool. One more down. See, look at this. Is he going to revive him or what? You know, when they have their back to me, I should probably use the axe. I think that's the point to use the axe. You know what I mean? Because, like, anytime I've hit someone in the back with the axe, they've gotten killed in one shot. Damn it. All right. Okay. There he goes. You dead? You dead now. And so are you. What? Oh, come on with this. Ugh, that really aggravates me. I hate wait, I hate having to waste uh, healing items when it wasn't my fault. She should have been dead, dude. I was wailing on her. Okay, let's keep the bodies right there. You're pissed off. I get it. And you're about to be dead. You dead? Come on, die, man. Do I got to cut your head off? Because I will. Oh, boy. This is, okay, here we go. Right, he doesn't look in a hurry, so let's go ahead. Nah, I'm not going to waste hours on him when it's just one guy. Yep, yep. You better run, dude. You better run. Man, you guys couldn't even take down my wall? I left the wall to you, and you still couldn't take it down. You're freaking pathetic, man. You really are pathetic, dude. I left that wall wide open. Wide open. Alright, well. Can you get a lot of bones here, at least? Let's go ahead and eat something. There we go. Oh boy, rough day, guys. Rough day. Man, I'm trying to get some work done. Bone zone's got to get done today, guys. It, that's as simple as that. All right, guys, I can finally get to work here, hopefully. Um, I think I've killed every cannibal on the island now. They're going to have to make new mutant baby cannibals to come get me. Uh, I shouldn't say that. I really don't want that. <laughs> I really don't want that. In case you guys are wondering what the bone zone is, the bone zone is basically a kill zone where I get a lot of bones from corpses. Okay. It's basically there for me to, it's basically a circle of happy birthday traps and it's basically set up so I could kill really easily. Okay. The only thing I really can't handle and honestly nothing can really handle them is mutants. Uh, mutants will break through anything. So, you know, but that's fine. Um, it will be good for what I need to do, and that's kill cannibals and get some bones. I do have a lot of bodies to burn. I will probably do it at night. Um, not really sure when I'm going to burn the bodies. I should probably do it soon, because I'm worried they're going to disappear. But, um, yeah, I really should. But this is more important. I need to get this thing set up. So, I threw some TNT here, and I got a... Uh, platform in the middle. The platform is going to be surrounded by happy birthday traps. That's simple. The bone zone. And then when I, like, I'll have a way to get in there. The reason I want it to be in, like, the front of my base is because I want the cannibals to be able to follow me to the bone zone. And this is, I think, going to be the most predominant place attacked. I can always make a bone zone down below if I need to, but, you know, hopefully I don't have to. I really don't want to make two of them. But I also need to get rid of some of these stumps. So let me get rid of some of these stumps now. Why am I doing it with this? I should be doing it with this, right? Right, sure. All right, let's get some uh, let's get some uh, energy back. I'm gonna try and make this a little bit bigger than last time. Uh, the last bone zone. The idea of the bone zone is not to be a big like place. It's to you know, it's just to be defensive and get it up as quickly as possible. But I'm probably gonna make this one a little bit bigger just to because I kind of want to try. There we go. And let's get rid of this one. And I have no stamina left. How many drinks do I have? Five. Okay. I usually save my drinks in case of emergencies, so I'm not going to use them now. This is not an emergency. Me being lazy and, and impatient is not an emergency. Did I hit this? Yes, I did. I think I hit it a couple times. All right. Um, we probably have to take out... Yeah, we got to take out more of these stumps. So let's get Let's get more of these stumps out of here. I will not throw any more TNT. I'm probably just going to go back after I have to get rid of these few stumps. Uh, that's good. I'll get rid of this one too. 
You don't want trees around it either, because cannibals will climb up the trees and then jump in the inside of the bone zone. And you don't want that. Alright, I'm just going to move this out of the way. Okay. And this looks pretty good. Alright, let me go home. Let me burn some bodies. Let me, um... Oh, really quick before I go, before I like actually cut the video, why don't we do this? Remember, uh, you could put, you could uh, come down here with bodies. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna put the bodies right here. Can I put in my stick holder? No. All right, let's put them right. Oh yeah, that's right. They fall through the bottom. Yeah, that sucks. I'd like to be able to lower them down. That'd be pretty cool. Anyway, I'm going to throw these bodies down below. I'm going to burn all of the bodies, guys. And then I'm going to sleep through the night. I'll see you in the morning. All right, guys. I'm back. All right. So, when I last uh, made the bone zone, I kind of would just, like, do the bone... Kind of do the bone zone by ear. And I wouldn't really measure anything. I'm going to actually measure stuff this time. Okay? And what I'm measuring here is... All right. We've got one, two... And one log sled sideways. Two log sleds and one sideways. And that's going to be one... Like, this is going to be flush with this wall. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these all on four sides. And then I'm going to combine them separate. Uh, you know, I'm going to combine all the four sides together. Instead of the way, way I normally did the bone zone. Um, the way I normally did the bone zone worked out. But it, it was pretty lucky. Like, it was, you know, this might be a little bit smoother. And might be a better um, building experience. So, yeah, I'm using the log sledge just again to make sure that these, you know, happy birthday traps are somewhat equal as, you know, as far as how far away they are from the uh, main platform in the middle. Um, and then we're just going to do it on all four sides and then we'll connect them up. Hopefully that'll work okay. Um, anytime you're putting down a happy birthday trap, make sure the uh, the little stick thing there is on the outside. Believe me when I tell you this, I've messed that up quite a few times before. And it's not fun. All right, so let's go ahead and... Basically, want that to be, uh, it's pretty flush, All right? And then we put it right, it doesn't, yeah, right in the middle. So right about there, okay? And then uh, we just connect them up, and we should be able to connect those up relatively easily. Uh, actually, let's connect those up now because the m most of the cannibals come from this side, and if I can use the bone zone in any, you know way shape or form that would be pretty cool the earlier the better the only thing i don't like about where i'm building is there's too much um there's too much like undergrowth and stuff around which is kind of annoying but what are you gonna do all right so this would have to go over to there so i'm thinking like maybe right here okay and uh, yeah maybe maybe i've never done it like this before so and then we put another one to connect those up. Nah, nah, that's that's too much of an angle. Too, way too much of an angle. All right, guys, we actually had some uninterrupted uh, uh, alone time, some me time, <laughs> and I got some work done. Uh, hopefully, we can have another day of uninterruption, which would be nice. Uh, but first of all, let's go ahead and grab some food. There we go, and we'll eat the rabbit first, and we'll take a swig of this, and we're ready to rock. Let me show you what I've done. I've gotten a quarter of the bone zone um, set up. It's not quite done yet. I want to kind of put it together with you guys. So that would be awesome. We're also going to head out to the cannibal camp. I went into the cannibal camp and um, grabbed some stuff. But I also restarted the game since then. It was getting a little laggy. So I restarted the game since then. So because I restarted the game, all that stuff will be um, refreshed again. Which will be awesome. So let's let's uh, keep our fingers crossed that I have some uh, uninterrupted build time here. Uh, this is my mistake. I should have made the bone zone first. I I should have even started the storage area. Okay, but it's here's where we are, and this is what we have to work with. So let's just do what we can. All right. So that's the part of the bone zone I got set up so far. So let's go ahead and throw some logs in here. If we can get a couple of these set up, at least we'll have some kind of, you know, we'll have some kind of defense. You know. Which would be nice. Uh, yeah, I've got to get a lot more sticks. All right. Well, you know what? I think I have some sticks over here somewhere. Oh, here they are. So let's go ahead and grab some of these sticks. Is the exact reason I was saving these up. There we go. Let's put all these sticks in here. This bone zone is gonna take a while. I'll probably make it over a few videos. Um, I, I, I didn't. I didn't realize if I was gonna make it this big, it's gonna be uh, quite expensive. And, and if I could just not get attacked for a little bit. That would really, really, really help. Um, let's do that. Let's do that. There we go. Okay, let's throw some in here. Uh, yeah, we definitely got to get some rope. Definitely got to get some rope. All right. 
right, so there we go with the logs, and we'll put these in here. Come on. All right, all right. Oh, here we go. We're being attacked again. Unbelievable. Yeah, you know, I am on their turf. You know, what are you gonna do? You know, you wanna, you wanna play around the cannibals. That's, that's the way it's gonna go. Sometimes you got these punks breathing down your neck. I've had a, I've had a long time of uninterruption, and um, I really should have been saving that. I should have been spending that time building traps. So, learn from my mistakes, guys. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Oh, there we go. There we go. And we need sticks to set these up again. There we go. So, these uh, cannibals ain't too bright. Even though I don't have a lot of these things set up, they'll still run into them. Which is nice. So, oh, that one ran into them too. Okay, so we're going to keep the bodies over here. Can I put the bodies? In? Yeah. I could put the bodies in a sled, but I'm not going to... I'm not gonna do that. Oh god, two of them ran in here. Look at this. We only had one. We only had two bone zone uh, happy birthday traps set up, but we, they're already doing work. I love it. That is awesome. I don't need it to kill everybody. I just needed to thin out the herd a little bit. I mean, last time they came out, we were like seven or eight guys. It was ridiculous. And they were working together. <laughs> it wasn't like one guy was hitting my wall and the other guys were kind of like looking at me and this and that. No, they were they were working together. It was a bit of a pain. But. All right, I'm definitely going to have to go in there and get some more rope. All right, so two more logs in there. There we go. All right, lady. It's time for you to go. Bye-bye. All right, I don't have enough stamina. If only she knew I didn't have enough stamina. Well, what she doesn't know could fill a book. Oh, this, these sticks aren't that good, are they? All right, well, it should be good enough. Oh, that one needs rope. And this one needs sticks. There we go. Oh, this one needs rope, too. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Alright, let's, uh... You know what? Let's go get some rope. Okay, yeah. I guys, learn from my mistake, man. Learn from my mistake. Once you get set up, get some kind of defenses going. I don't care if you use the bone zone like I do. If you use something else. Whatever you're gonna do, get something going. Because they're gonna come in on you. And I gotta grab rags as well. So I keep destroying their, uh... They're little, uh, I don't know what these things... They're effigies. I guess those are, like, their version of effigies. Hello. Nope, nope. We're good. We're good. What did I come here for? Oh, yeah. Rope. I'm not gonna mess with these guys because it's not worth it. Like, especially here. It's not even like I'm gonna get the, uh... Uh, let's go ahead and drink and take that. It's not even like I'm gonna get their bones because I'm not gonna, like, drag their bodies all over the, you know, all over the place. All right, whatever, man. We're cool. We cool. We cool. All right, take it easy there. Oh, take it easy, there, lady. Put put some clothes on. How many do we have? Two. There should be another couple rope around here somewhere. Where is? The oh, there's. There they are. Okay. Let's get some stamina back. Let's grab these two rope and let's GTFO. All right, I'm out. I'm out. You're home. Your house. Your rules. You want to eat each other? Who am I to stand in your way? Although, they don't really like me break- I'm sorry, I don't- Listen, topless naked lady. I don't mean to be a jerk. But I need cloth. What am I gonna- What- What am I to do? What am I to do? Right? Right? Yeah, you- You get me. You get me. Uh, I don't think he gets me. <laughs> Alright, let's come around here. Let's set up the bone zone traps again. Hello. You gonna attack? No, you're not gonna attack. No, shut up. Shut your freaking face. All right, they're on the wrong side of the bone zone. That's not good. Let's get them over here. Come on, over here, guys. Over here. They're all confused. All right, so she set it off the wrong way. Oh, she jumped over them. Nope, that one's not done yet. That's why. There, now it's done. Walk into it. Oh, come on, jerk. I'm trying to make a bone zone here. Who doesn't like a bone zone? You know what I'm saying? Oh, good, he jumped over the thing. Oh, wait, no, that one wasn't done, was it? There, now it's done. All right, guys. Come on in. Water's fine. All right, I don't want to use these. Yeah, we'll use these. Oh. Oh, damn. You've got some dodging skills, bro. Oh, there's one dead. See? Now this separates them. This separates them. Even a couple of happy birthday traps like this. It separates them, which is what we really want. See? Look at them. Two are dead over there. And you're going to follow. 
Nope. You missed. Swing and a miss! No. No, you're not getting away. Nope. You're done, pal. You should have ran while you had the chance. Actually, you never had a chance. Alright, guys. Look at this. Just a couple of happy birthday traps has swung, has swung it into my favor. Alright? I mean, I still have to fight him, and it's still annoying, but it's not as bad. Can I, is this one finished? Yeah, that one's finished. So all these are finished. Good. Now, you need a stick to reset these, so just keep that in mind when you guys use uh, happy birthday traps. you too slow, lady. Oh, too slow. Man, she, she was really slow. All right, guys, there's no way this thing's getting done today. Uh, I just got interrupted way, way too much, and I can't be making a three-hour video today. Actually, if I was going to finish it today, it would be like four hours. Um... Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna kind of work on this for the rest of the video, and uh, you know, we'll uh, we'll definitely get it done next time. Yeah, it sounds like we got some uh, baddies coming. We're just getting inter interrupted too much. By the way, you might be wondering why I'm making a catapult like this. Uh, it's because it's the only place you could put uh, skulls in. By the way, I'm almost full armor, and I still have a I still have three bone armor on me. So no matter what, this has really helped because I needed the bones quite a bit. Let's take a look at our total armor. Our total armor is 430, which is pretty pretty good. So, are right, you going to run in? Come on, dude, run in. Please, do me the favor. Come on, bro. Oh, right over his head. There he goes. Headshot. I'm going to leave him. Actually, I'm not going to leave. Nah, whatever. I don't need to go. I was going to say, I'm going to go get my arrow. But you know what, man? I got... I'll be okay with arrows. I will be okay with arrows. Let's stay focused here. Um, so we got two log sleds and then the sideways one. And then we need to put a happy birthday trap right here. So, yeah, I can't believe I'm not getting done with the bones. You know, it's a bigger bone zone, guys. It's a lot bigger than usual. And plus, like I said, the um, the cannibals are upset for some reason. I, I'm not really sure why. I don't speak their language or, you know, understand the way they do things. But... You know, something about me burning them, like, and wearing their bones is kind of making them upset. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. That tree's got to go. Damn it. Yep. That tree's got to go. Got to go, tree. Better not fall on my... F you better not fall on anything important. I swear to goodness. I also made a place for me to save uh, here. As you can see, there's a... There's a little uh, makeshift temporary shelter thingy right there. And I also have a... Uh, I also have a uh, bone holder... Uh, bone basket uh, in the process of being made that I haven't finished yet, but I'm definitely going to finish that. So let's come on over here and bring these over here. We're definitely going to finish this bone zone next video. No doubt, guys. No doubt. It's going to be really cool, though, man. I'm excited. It's going to be a lot bigger than usual, which I don't really see any downside about, about it being bigger. I don't think it's going to mess up the build at all, which is really awesome. And the cool thing about it being bigger is that it leaves me more room to build stuff inside of it. All right, so that looks pretty good to me right about there. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty good. Might be a little bit too close, but whatever. It's it's okay. It's fine. Actually, no, it's not. The hell with that. <laughs> Nothing's fine. Get it right, Cage. Don't be lazy. All right, so I'm thinking like right there. Yep, that looks good to me. I'm glad I did that. Alright, let's go put it on the uh, last corner, and then we just have to hook them all in. And, oh, uh, this thing's right in the freaking way, isn't it? Alright, that's okay. Shouldn't be a problem. Um, yeah, and then we just have to get all the stuff. Honestly, the rope's gonna be the hardest part. I know of, like, six rope that I can get without restarting the game. So, and each one takes two. So that's only, uh, you know, that's not a lot of, that's only three uh, happy birthday traps. So, we're definitely gonna have to, I'm gonna do some farming off camera. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, I think I'm going to go down into the, um, into the caves in that cannibal camp over there, the caves that I've already been in. I think I'm going to go down there as well and grab some stuff that's down there. Because everything down there should be dead because I've already been in there. And I could just go down there and get stuff. And stuff does respawn in the caves. Like, everything respawns in the caves. Which is quite nice. Alright. Shut up, timer. Let's just get this last one down. Alright. Come on. How's that? Now a little bit more. Yeah, it's good enough. Alright. Oh, come on with the freaking tree. You're killing me. You're killing me. Don't didn't, don't you know my timer already went off? You freaking inconsiderate piece of crap, nature. I hate you, nature. 
I really hate nature. I really do. I like rainy days. I hate the sun. I hate the birds. It's freaking birds, man. I've had a bird. I work at a train kiosk, right? Which is like an indoor little area at the train station. Um, this is a lot closer. Eh, whatever. Um, and there was, there's been a bird in there for like two days. We finally got it out today. And I'm just like, you little... Um, it just wouldn't get out. We kept trying to... We, we had the doors open. There's two doors. They were both open. We're trying to get the bird out. The stupid bird is flying into the freaking glass windows above the door. Like, he wouldn't go low enough to, like, fly out the door. It was so irritating. And then finally we got him out today. I got some help. Um, some guy came by and helped me. Uh, we had a couple brooms, and we, we just we got him out of there. So, that was nice. All right. Uh, like, right about there. Uh, that's pretty good. It should be okay. It's definitely... A, it feels a little off. Doesn't it? No, it's really not. This one feels a little closer. Yeah, no, that's, that's, pretty, that's pretty good. All right, guys. I am going to call this one here. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Okay, guys. A little bit of post-video commentary here. Um, I don't know if any of you guys noticed this and maybe mentioned it in the comments um, before I ended the video. But I couldn't put down a ghost image next to a happy birthday trap that was already made. I've had this issue before. I don't know why I can't remember that. Don't freaking finish the ghost image until you're done. Because when, when you have a ghost image and a real, like, already made trap or building or whatever, they won't go inside of each other like this. You have to finish all the ghost images. I have to finish the entire circle before I can make any of these freaking traps. I don't know why I have trouble remembering that. But I just wanted to mention at the end of the video, I had to break them all up and uh, replace all these. And, um, yeah, what a pain in the ass. I lost a few... I lost a few rope there. I lost a bunch of stuff, but eh, what are you going to do? Anyway, guys, I am going to call this one here. Actually, I already did my outro, so I'm not going to do the outro again. Uh, that's the real end of the video, guys. I'll see you next time.